All right, so if you watch the other video clip, I already walked you through everything you're going to get in that kit. So when you receive the box, you'll know exactly what to expect. What I want to talk about in this video clip is what I'm really excited about, because this kit is so much more than just pretty stuff. Um, and it's really cool that it's both boy and girl. It's reversible so that if you don't know what you're having or if you want to get this as a baby shower gift, which is, by the way, a very good idea, and they don't know what they're having, it can work for either boy or girl. So stock up before these are gone. Um, but let me just tell you about the concept of this album because I, I did Porter's baby album and Claire's baby album and that's kind of where my experience came from in developing this kit and the whole concept. And now that um, we have a third baby and we just had crew last week, I want to tell you that I just spent an hour over the weekend just kind of opening up the box and getting everything sorted and organized into sheet protectors and I feel so excited because this will be by far the easiest baby album that I've done so far and I'm really excited. So what you're going to do when you get your kit is go ahead and do the same thing. There's sheet protectors in the kit, remember, so go ahead and put them all in the album and then they were sorted pages one and then two and three, four and five and so forth. So this right here I slipped into sheet protector is everything that you need for page one. I just slipped it in and notice it's loose. I didn't actually adhere anything down. So now everything that I'm showing you, by the way, is boy. So on the back side of all of this is the pink stuff. Okay, so just remember, everything that you're seeing is boy, but to every boy thing you see, there is pink. So this is the title page. And then it's, if you see a glare, David, just let me know. Um, our family tree is over here. All you have to do is put the pictures in. This is the story of us where you're going to put pictures of... Um, you and your spouse. You can write the story about how you met and fell in love and got married. This is where mom writes about dad and then dad writes about mom on the other side and you can put little pictures of you growing up and then there's also chipboard blocks just to fill in space if you want to. The next layout is expecting you and this is for your pregnant pictures, your ultrasounds, whatever you want. And then this is a pocket that I didn't actually fold. Again, I'm just sticking everything in page protectors right now. So what you're going to do is it comes die cut and scored. So all you have to do is fold it, put a little adhesive there like that, and you can see how that's a pocket. So all of these journaling cards are included in the album. This is one of the best features of this kit is that it has all of these prompts so you know you can, you can write about anything you want. But we've got miscellaneous notes preparing for you, highlights during pregnancy, discovering you were on your way. Okay, so that's just an example. I won't go through all the specifics on all of the journaling cards, but you at least get the idea for what those are about. Okay, the next layout is being showered. So even if you don't, don't have a baby shower, this is stuff of like how you were spoiled, gifts that you were given, things that people did for you. And again, journaling cards for the pocket. Your arrival, of course, is the day that the baby's born, and then um, I included one of these little mini memorabilia pockets right here as a snap enclosure, or snap closure, and I put our hospital bracelets in there. And of course, that journaling includes lots of prompts to help you know what to write about on the day the baby's born. Sometimes you can't think of all the details that you want to write about, so that's what that's helpful for. Your very first days, um, that's what this layout is for, so it has choosing your name, First visitors, bringing you home, and adjusting to life in a family. You are official. This is really generic broad. You could use it for birth certificate, um, uh, the baby announcement that you send out, anything about baby being official. First home, I think, is really important no matter where you live. Include um, details about baby's first home so they can always remember where we live, what we love, your bedroom. This will also give you ideas on what to take pictures of. So if you're kind of stumped for ideas on details that you should photograph, then this will help prompt those. Um, and then this is one of those divided sheet protectors. I just stuck one in here and just to show you. This is for the time capsule. This is really neat. I've um, given you prompts to include a current postage stamp and of course it goes through details like our country's leaders, the cost of living for different things, the cost of car, cars, gas, um, all sorts of stuff. So these are also double-sided. And then, this is the monthly layouts. And I'll just show you a couple. You don't need to see all 12. But there's the label for the month. And then you can choose any cardstock that you want to use. And this is where you can write the details 
of that baby's first month, and on the back it even has 1 through 31, so you can mark special days for the calendar days. So that's the same for all of the monthly layouts. So I think this should be making sense to you now. Um, this is another one of the divided sheet protectors, actually a couple, and then in the back, I've already been throwing stuff in the memorabilia pockets for crew. Miscellaneous has some ultrasound pictures and stuff, and then cards and I'm still going to decide what I want to use this one for. So that's it. That's the concept. Be sure to stock up for baby gifts because this will be such a huge relief and solution for any new mom.